Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Reese's Pieces with cookie biscuit, pretzel, milk chocolate, caramel, and a peanut. I ordered all of these from Amazon. These are actually made by Hershey Canada. So all of these came from Canada. So uh, don't pass out when I tell you how much they cost. They were not cheap. They were not cheap, but I wanted to try them. And unfortunately, we don't get them here. So I'll give you the prices. Um, the milk chocolate bag was eleven sixty-five. One bag. Eleven dollars and sixty-five cents. <laughs> The caramel was $12.54. The uh, chocolate cookie, is this the cookie yeah. one? The cookie one was $17.99, so $18. The uh, peanut one is $17.85. And the, huh? Pretzel. The pretzel one was $9.99. So it just, like I said, they all came from Amazon, and it just depends on who you order from and who you can get them from. You know, I got what I could got what I could get from who I could get it from, so I just did it. Um, it I'm thinking it's a one-time thing for me, and uh, so I, I want to try them. So this is a uh, peanut. Yeah, it does say no. It says peanut butter covered cookie in a crunchy shell. It is 17 pieces or 190 calories. Okay. Most of the time I found Amazon food stuff is, is expensive. Amazon food is a very expensive. Uh, now, that's all colors they have. Uh, they have a brown one. They have chocolate colors. Kind of loud, isn't it? Um, yeah, Amazon food is expensive, but I have told you all before in other videos, the coffee, the coffee, you can get really good deals on coffee. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. It's a little cookie. It's like a little, little planet. Mm-hmm. The molten core. <laughs> hmm. It Definitely tastes, changes them. Yeah, but if you still get a Reese's Pieces because you get the peanut, uh, the peanut butter. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know why. I was I wasn't expecting it to have that peanut butter. And it yeah, does. Yeah, that's peanut it's Reese's pieces with mm -hmm. something in the middle basically. I truly just wasn't expecting Kind of like a peanut M M is a chocolate M M with a peanut in the middle. These are just with, with peanut butter. I think those are really good though. They're really good. And you do get the you still get the peanut butter. You mm -hmm. get a little bit of that chocolate cookie flavor. Yeah, it, it mainly though, honestly, it mainly still tastes just like Reese's pieces. Mm -hmm. You get a little added texture to it. It's too. really just a crunchy Reese's Pieces. Yeah, but it, it tastes like Reese's Pieces yeah. to me. The cookie does make a little bit of difference. A little, but, but not much. Hard. And I also I didn't expect it with that one anyway because cookie's gonna be fine. Um, I am expecting it a little bit more with this one because it's pretzel and it's peanut butter covered pretzels in a crunchy shell. That price said peanut butter too. And I, you know, I read that. <laughs> but it did not register at all that it would still have peanut butter. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah. Uh, 18 pieces is 190 calories. I wonder if they're going to look exactly the same. I'm sure they'll look the same. Yeah. Well, they're a little bigger. They're a little, like, knobbier. Yeah. Like, look at this. This... Lumpy. Yeah. This reminds you of, like, a peanut M&M. Mm-hmm. Oh, well. These yellow ones look like lemons. <laughs> they do. Mm, I like that too. Oh, I like it, and I get the difference in texture, but I can't honestly say that I'm tasting it. I get the texture and the it, texture, but you don't get a lot of like the salt or anything like that. Mm -mm. They're like little um. Pretzel nuggets, like little like little triangles or little squares of pretzel covered in the peanut butter. That's what they are. It's it's not bad. Yeah. No, it, it you know it it did I think diminish the peanut butter a little bit. I think as far as these two, you taste more of that 
strong peanut butter in the biscuit, in oh, the yeah. cookie one. Yeah, definitely. Um, but as far as like tasting pretzel, did you mm -hmm. taste pretzel? Not really, you just get the texture. And you don't get any saltiness. Uh, the saltiness is the disappointing part. Because, I wish you got the salt. Yeah, part. I was hoping for some salt. So I can eat them, they're, they're wonderful. Yeah, I, the they're thing good. about these two is, um, how do you not eat a whole bite? No. I mean, really, these are just milk chocolate. So peanut butter covered uh, chocolate in a crunchy shell. 19 pieces is 200 calories. These are smaller. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> yeah, these remind me more of a an M&M. Or a super sized um, Reese's Pieces. Mm -hmm. Now that is a completely different flavor. It is because the, well look how thin the peanut butter is. Yeah, I'm not getting hardly any peanut butter. That no longer tastes like Reese's Pieces no, at all. it's more like a, it's more like an M&M kind of mm -hmm. flavor, although it's a different chocolate than m, &M. Yeah, you, it doesn't have the chocolate. M&M flavor is mm -hmm. very distinct mm -hmm. chocolate flavor. It's not that. Yeah. Try to pull one apart. There it is. Yeah, you can see it. it is good. I like it. I love the texture of it. The texture is, it's uh, that chocolate part on the inside is very soft. Mm -hmm. And I like that with that crunchy shell. But if I was wanting Reese's Pieces, I'm never going to pick these because it's it's not Reese's Pieces no, it's anymore. Too thin. The reason I'm buying the Reese's Pieces is because I love peanut butter. That doesn't have enough. Yeah, I agree. It needed to be, the chocolate needed to be about the size of that cookie piece, or just a little ball in the middle instead of a, a big disc. Right. But it's, I mean, they're good. They're You're, still very yeah. good. Yeah. Um, if you want less peanut butter, you would like those. What do you want me for? Pour my mouth. Kevin has a way he wants to do things on the plate. I'm a picky person. He's a picky person. That's okay. I'm trying not to mix them in. He sets me up for the end of the video. I have a picture at the end, and he always sets me up. Okay, peanut butter covered caramel flavored milk chocolate. So these are the caramel. 19 pieces is 200. Boy, I smell it. Wow, smell that. Mm. Really strong. Oh, yum. It's just like the chocolate ones. Mm. You do get that caramel flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the exact same shape and and everything as the chocolate, except it's caramel. It's really good. I like it. I like it too. Not a Reese's Pieces. Oh, it you don't get any peanut butter. No, you don't get any peanut butter at all. You only get caramel. It's it's like, car but it's not a um, it's not a dense caramel. It still is a very um, it has a very similar texture to chocolate. Only. Yeah, it does. But but that caramel flavor is really strong and sweet. Mm -hmm. um, it's it, almost like a caramel syrup you put on ice cream. Yeah, it's probably honestly it's probably the sweetest <clears throat> one we've had so far. I agree. It's very 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 sweet. I agree. Yeah. Um, this is the one I'm looking forward to With the, the most because I'm a peanut lover. Uh, peanut butter covered peanuts in a crunchy shell. 13 pieces. Wow, we've really gone down for the same calories, for 200 calories. Yeah, these are all 18, 19. Yeah, 18, 19 pieces for 200. Now we've gone down to, to 13 pieces for 200. So yeah, you're not getting near as many. Oh, you don't want me to put it in your hand? I'll just give you that many. I'll eat one over here. Ooh, wow, it's, I want this big yellow one. Hmm. The peanut is really strong. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like the peanut in a peanut M&M. Mm-hmm. No big peanuts. It's just like a peanut M&M. Except in having the M and M chocolate, you have the Reese's peanut butter. I do want them. Mm -hmm. It's good. I like but, that. But I still don't get a really strong peanut butter flavor anymore. I tell you what, I love it's that. Good. That like takes me back to my days of well, eating a peanut. &M &M. Where I would buy a whole bag of peanut M and M's and sit there and eat half the bag mm -hmm. and would think nothing of it. 
Um, gone are those days. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Um, yeah. I like I it, but it's more peanut than it peanut is. butter. It is. Medium. No, I agree. The one yeah. that had the strongest peanut butter flavor the was the very first one mm -hmm. because the cookie the cookie did not interfere with the peanut butter flavor. Yeah. It doesn't interfere with that. You taste all peanut butter. Um, but then I so I love that one. But I'm gonna I'm still gonna pick this one as my favorite though. Um, I think my favorite. I'm gonna go with peanut for favorite, and then the cookie second. My co the cookie one's probably my favorite. Um, I'm leaning between the peanut and the caramel because I really like the caramel one too. E either one of those could I could eat either one of those honestly mm -hmm. for a number two. Cookie would be my first one. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but the other ones aren't bad. The chocolate and the pretzel aren't bad at all. They just you don't get any peanut butter really. You don't get the caramel either, but I like the caramel flavor. And you don't get the, you get the lumpy bumpy of the pretzel, but you don't get a flavor there's, of a Yeah, there's no salt yeah. or anything. It didn't really add anything to it. That's why I kind of, it's, it's okay. So I'm one that, it, like Kevin, I think we're the same. Once you find your favorite, why would you buy something that's not your favorite? Yeah. So we would always choose. I'm always going to choose either peanut or cookie. Yeah. Yeah. One and I might those. throw the caramel on there. And he's, yeah. But it is a not strong Not for $13 a bag though. No. <laughs> Or $15. I have whatever. Canadian viewers. You're going to have to tell me how much these cost. So, like, if What would we, it be in U.S. dollars, not Canadian dollars? Not Canadian dollars, because it is different. But I was going to ask you, if we were to see these in the candy out at Walmart, wouldn't you expect to pay about six bucks yeah, or something? Yeah, about six dollars. I would think, and I don't know, but I would think about six dollars. Five or six, yeah. Um, so, so I'm thinking about a big bag of peanut M&Ms is about... $5. Yeah, so, see, I don't even have a clue because yeah. I haven't bought a bag in a long time. I don't pay attention because I don't buy them. Uh, but yeah, this uh, I'm, I'm just assuming that something with peanuts like that, it would cost about $6. But like I said, you have to weigh it out. Is it worth it to you to try these? How much do you love Reese's Pieces? You know, and if, if, you, if you're not a big peanut butter fanatic and if you don't have to have the newest thing, then you might pass on these. I'm hoping they'll bring them here. Why yeah, not? They should. Take a truck across the border. You know, they they need to, to be here as well. But I know the Canadians are saying that about a lot of things we have too. Because yeah. I get the comments. Mm -hmm. We need those here. So Sometimes you know, they make it in Canada and ship here and they don't even sell them. Anymore. And they don't even sell it to you all. So it's, <laughs> it's not hilarious. fair. It's really not fair at all. Um, you never know. These might be made in America. And they're not. It actually <laughs> says Hershey Canada. Yeah. So it's, it's actually there. But... But I hope you enjoyed the video. If you've had any of these, you'll have to let us know. If you have seen them somewhere sold in the United States, you can let me know because you know there's stores up closer to the border mm -hmm. and some of those stores do get Canadian items like chips and stuff like that. They do get Canadian items in their store. You might have already seen these and we just never got them. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.